Okay, so hey guys, we are back playing Undertale. When I left off, I was at this silly spider fight and it drove me nearly insane. Not 100%, but nearly. I don't want to listen to your spiel. I'm not even reading it. I don't care anymore. Oh, there you are. Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet eating her curds and whey. Then came a spider that sat down beside her, scaring Miss Muffet away. is not working today and that's why I'm not using it. guys okay I'm back chicken alarm eating dry elbow macaroni for some reason WD Gaster next game I'm gonna be playing is oh yes everyone can see all my fat now that's lovely oh 
Ta da! Trademark from Scott Cawthon! Woo! <laughs> I'm gonna hate it! <laughs> I'm gonna hate it, and you guys are gonna hate me! So lovely! We all get to win! <sighs> Remember to press the right buttons this time! As to not. Does it say hugs free? School free drug zone. It's labeled under in my screen room recorder. Screencast-O-Matic is just amazing. It's a bit glitchy when it comes to Spore, which I don't understand quite why it does that, but it's a great screen recorder. One time I was playing Super Mario Sunshine, and um, I got so angry at one of the floodless levels that I had to put gloves on in order to keep myself from getting blisters because of the anger levels. I was squeezing the controller so hard. Can you hear me? Sorry. Headphones broke again. Got new ones. Broke. Got newer ones! <laughs> and I knocked over my computer with them! I will fix this for you. One second. Okay guys, I'm back. I grabbed my father's headphones that he won for being a good employee and can't break because, you know, cordless. I mean, like, I guess you could pull the cord out on accident, but oh my goodness, this is fine. Nothing. There you go. I think I said screencast-o-matic earlier. I don't actually recommend that. I use OBS. Uh, it's amazing. Open Broadcaster. It's just wow. Yep, definitely gas. I'm gassy too. <laughs> that one's a bit easier. Or why I sound like Gruntilda. But <laughs> that 
That was a goofy, goofy impression, not purposely done. Oh, a yummy cup of spiders. Yum. editing bug it was a human error I messed up but luckily no one watched that video in time so no one heard my name and if you did please keep it to yourself but now that I said that you're gonna share, so. Maybe one person tell my real name? And me talking to my father, but. I don't think anyone cares at this point. blurry and it makes it a bit harder to game when your eyes are blurry I'm always itchy no one can ever figure out why I'm well, I'm sure someone's figured out how I'm itchy but I'm always itchy This whole episode is just gonna be a fuck battle!
<laughs> I'm in pain. Oh Lord, please help me. Oh no, I don't know why I'm praying. Why not play video games? But I do it a lot. play. I can tell by the music. I forget 100% what it's called, but the music. Oh my love, as but please run away. Monster King forbids your stay. Humans must live far apart, even if it breaks my heart. They'll put you in the dungeon. <laughs> It'll suck, <laughs> and then you'll die. <laughs> really sad You're gonna die Cry, cry, cry So sad is happening So sad Alright, uh -huh, you're going to the dungeon Well, toodles <laughs> I really am so sorry, I haven't uploaded in forever. Mm -hmm. The map has been cast away into the dungeon! A dungeon with a puzzle so dastardly my permanent will perish. Oh heavens mercy, the horrible colored tile maze. Each colored tile has its own to disappointment. For example, the game sounds of the noise and then you must find a monster. Wait a second. Didn't we see this puzzle about a hundred years ago? That's right, you remember all the rules, don't you? Great, then I won't waste your time repeating them. Oh, and you'd better hurry. Because if you don't get through in 30 seconds, you'll be incinerated by these jets of fire. Ah ha 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 ha. My poor love. I'm so filled with grief, I can't stop laughing. Good luck, darling. You know, I do that sometimes. I like So sorry, looks like you're out of time. Here come the flames, darling. 
They are closing in. Getting closer, oh my. Any minute now. <coughs> watch, watch out, I'll save you. I'm hacking into the firewall right now. Oh no, how could this happen? Foiled again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys. Seize. <laughs> That's right. Come on, Metaton. Give up already. You'll never be able to defeat us. Not as long as we work together. Your puzzle's over. Now go home and leave us alone. Puzzle over. Alphys Darlene, what are you talking about? Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make a sound, then you have to fight a monster. Well, darling, that monster is me. it, darling. Say goodbye. If I got your phone, you'd better answer it. <coughs> hey, this seems bad, but don't worry. There's one last thing I installed on your phone. You see that yellow button? Go to the phone's app menu and press it. Yeah, well, you press the yellow button. The phone is ready. Ooh. Ooh. You've defeated me. How can this be? You were stronger than I thought, etc. Whatever. <laughs> Look, looks like you beat him. You, you did a really good job out there. All thanks to you. What? No. No, no. I mean... You were the one doing everything cool. I just wrote some silly programs for your phone. Um, hey, this might sound strange, but can I tell you something? Before I met you, I didn't really, I didn't really like myself very much. For a long time, I felt like a total screw up. Woohoo! Welcome to my world. Like I couldn't do anything without without ending up letting everyone down. But guiding you has made me feel a lot better about myself. So thanks for letting me help you. Uh, anyway, we're almost to the core. It's just past Metaton Resort. Come on, let's finish this. I think I've seen someone actually complete this puzzle. Like, later and stuff. See you later. <laughs> Hey, I'm ready to go into the core. How about grabbing some dinner with me first? Yeah. Great, thanks for treating me. Over here, I know a shortcut. Well, here we are. So, the journey's almost over, huh? You must really want to go home. Hey, I know the feeling, but oh, no. Maybe sometimes it's better not to take what's given to you. Down here, you've already got food, drink, friends. It's what you have to do. Really worth it? Ah, uh, forget it. I'm ready for you, kid. Hey. 
Let me tell you a story. So I'm a century in the snapped forest, right? I set out there and fought for humans. It's kind of boring. Fortunately, deep in the forest, there's this huge locked door. And it's perfect for practicing knock-knock jokes. So one day, I'm knocking them out like usual. I knock on the door and say, knock-knock. And suddenly, from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Who's there? Come on, how hard is it to Google? I think he was talking about Toriel. So, naturally, I respond. Dishes. No? Probably. Dishes who? Dishes who? Dishes is a very bad joke. Then she just howls with laughter. Like it's the best joke she's heard in a hundred years. So I keep on coming. And she keeps laughing. She's the best audience I've ever had. Then, after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, knock, knock. I say, who's there? Old lady. Old lady who? Oh, I did not know you could yodel. <laughs> Old lady who? <laughs> wow. Needless to say, this woman has an extremely good. We keep telling each other jokes for hours. Eventually, I had to leave. Papyrus gets kind of cranky without his bedtime story. But she told me to come by again. So I did. Then I did again. And again. It's a thing now. Telling bad jokes through the door. It rules. One day, though, I noticed she wasn't laughing very much. I asked her what it was up. Then she told me something strange. If a human ever comes through this door, could you please, please promise something? Watch over them and protect them, will you not? Now, I hate making promises, and this woman, I don't even know her name, but someone who sincerely likes bad jokes has an integrity you can't say no to. Do you get what I'm saying? That promise I made to her, you know what would have happened if she hadn't said anything? Buddy. <gasps> Chills! Fine. Why? I thought you liked me. Hey, lighten up, bucko. I'm just joking with you. Bes oh, thank God. Besides, haven't I done a great job protecting you? I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. Hey, what? Hey, that looks supposed to mean. Am I wrong? Heh. <laughs> Well, that's all. Take care of yourself, kid. Because someone really cares about you. I think he means him. I'm hoping he means him.
determination. So he's allowed to smoke in the Metatiton Resort Resort. Nobody else is supposed to be here. Oh well, we can't worry about that now. Ready? This is it. Take the elevator up to the top of the corner. The elevator isn't working. What? The elevator should be working. Well then, go to the right and keep heading up. Alright, now just keep heading up. That pit isn't on my map. Forget it. Let's just keep... Let's just run on the left side. I think I went right. Okay. You should be able to make it through here. W watch out. That was close. Well, why are there so many monsters here? I mean, it's no problem, right? Well, we're, we're just got to keep heading forward. Looks like you can't proceed until you hit the switch, but those lasers will activate when you do. Um, looks like they're coming this order. Blue, blue, orange. <laughs> G got it? Move until... Oh my god, are you hurt? I, I'm so sorry. I, I gave you the wrong order. Everything's gonna be fine, okay? L let's just keep heading to the right. What's my health? Really annoying for you. 
I'll buy it. Sorry, I, I, I thought that I must try the right path instead. Poor Alfie's. Okay guys, I'm back! Holy shit! Hold it! Hold it! Guys, I'm back! <laughs> I think I killed that wasp. I'm gonna take this. I almost peed. Oh, I'm so scared. It was so scary. I hit the wasp because I was just hiding the thing. I think it's dead though. I don't know for sure, but I think it might be dead. <sighs> Why are you hurting me? What's a lot of time you understand me? Thank <laughs> you. 
Is that where that guy's eyes goes? I'm going to save it after I got the Eric Glamberger. And we're gonna go straight. Because you know what? I did that with Miss Muffet, and I'm doing that here because I am ticked. This is hard! Seriously, you go buy this game for $10, or you can pirate it, I don't care. But you can get this game for $10, and you play this game and just see how hard it is. Like, I played Super Mario Galaxy and 2, and now that I look back at it, it doesn't look hard. But I'm sure it is. So you play this game, and you will see what I'm going through. Bye-bye! <sighs>